All right, so we've got the season opener in the English Premier League, everybody's favorite league for European football. And we got my team. Been a Man U supporter my entire life. And uh, this one is not a homer pick, but I like Man U a lot in this one. Man U's got a great season record when it comes to home openers. And uh, they've got a solid record playing games at their home stadium here in Old Trafford in general when they play at night. 4-0 in their last four games played on a Friday night. Going up against Fulham, one of the bottom half of the table teams last year. I think they're going to be worse this year, quite frankly. They've lost some uh, important personnel. The absence of Polina is going to hurt their offense quite a bit, and they haven't really replaced them. Also very poor on the road last season, just four wins across 19 games. I think Man U's got them covered. Captain Bruno Fernandez is always one to watch in these late night games throughout the EPL. He's got a, a goal or, or an assist in five of his last six games played at night. And his last six games against Fulham, he's got four goals and an assist. I think he'll be involved in a goal or two here. But I think this, uh, this match tends to start out rather low event. Uh, in the last four games, we've seen draws at halftime between these two teams. Three of those four was 0-0 at half. This is a revenge spot for Man U. They they had an embarrassing defeat, one to two, the last time Fulham came to Old Trafford. I think Man U gets it done, and I think they watch their P's and Q's, probably to nil in my in my uh, estimation. Probably a two zero win for Man U here. But the way I want to look at this game in order to cut down on that vig on the Man U money line is to take Man U and under four and a half total goals scored in the game. That gets you to plus money. And I think that's a, that's a nice way to cover. It brings in that possibility of a 4-0 if they do run up the score or a 3-1 if Fulham does score after all. So give me Man U on the money line and under four and a half total goals in the game, plus 110.